Pope Francis has made one of the signatures of his pontificate, the Church of the Margins, and going to the periphery. And Myanmar and Bangladesh are on the margins. In 1852, uh, Father Moreau was asked to send religious to Bangladesh. So many other religious communities had balked at that request because of the difficult climate, uh, the long distance, uh, the difficulty of making inroads in a predominantly Muslim and Hindu country, but Father Moreau did not hesitate and sent religious to Bangladesh, and they have worked there since then to educate the youth of Bangladesh and to serve the poor in heroic ways. So you can imagine, it's, it's as though uh, the Holy Father is, is coming home to our very roots. Um, and it's a wonderful moment for, for the Congregation of Holy Cross uh, and for Notre Dame. This Catholic Holy Cross College, which is essentially a, what we'd call a prep school, has been an incredible mustard seed in that country by bringing Catholic education and security and uh, ethical training to the, the people who are leading Bangladesh now. We were chosen to be one of four sites where the Pope would actually have an event. And our event is a gathering of youth. And this is a special event. He could see some other people. He could see something else, no? but he chose especially the youth that he would like to meet and all sorts of youth from coming from all religion. It's something they think is very important. Quelli studenti erano tutti diversi, ma stavano tutti lavorando per il bene comune. Questo è importante, non dimenticate. Diversi, ma lavorando per il bene comune, in armonia. The blessing of the foundation stone for the new university will be a permanent marker of this event. The Pope's visit uh, will uh, give us the inspiration, the guidance, the vision in our new structure as we begin to build in that direction. We choose to regard it as um, a turning point. <laughs>